So what's up people and welcome to another episode of Pamela. So it's been a while since I made the last update and I apologize for the delay in making the next video. I've been kind of busy in my real life. I'm not sure if you saw my little notification video. But uh, things were going on that I couldn't really stop and make any, any videos, whether it's uh, Pamela or any of the other games. Now, things are starting to settle down again, and I'm starting to have some time to be able to make these videos again. And so I thought I'd come back and uh, start off exactly where I left off. So if you recall in my last episode, I was looking for the final uh, power transfer station somewhere I think in uh, the Oasis and I've been playing this game a bit since that time and with the help of Permian grad who gave me some basic uh, tips on where that last power transfer relay was I was able to find it and so what I wanted to do in this video was uh, retrace my steps and give you some idea of where that last power transfer station is and so thank you very much Permian grad for the information and uh, let's get started in this game. Okay, so we're back here at the fifth floor underground of the garrison. And overall, it's basically the same as we had before. We had these power transmitters and all the other stuff that we have in the base. And I do need to power up this uh, solar cell or, or ion core or whatever that thing is called. I forgot what it was called. Whoa, whoa. I punched it. I don't remember what controls I'm supposed to use anymore. My gosh, a couple of weeks and I'm already losing all of my uh, memory on how to run this game. Okay, well anyway, I guess I need to move a few things around so that I can open my, up some space for this ion core. So let me do that and get that and uh, see if I could put that in the container. Okay. I gotta go get another one of these ion cores from the drawer so that I could put it in there. But uh, for before I do that, let me put the uh, depleted one in this little container here so that I could take it to one of the other uh, solar chargers that's uh, nearby. But I could do that later. In any case, uh, yeah. Okay, let me just get this and then uh, get the another ion core which I have stockpiled here. Yeah, I got quite a few ion cores now. They're not that hard to make and so uh, I figure I have a few of them in case uh, I need to uh, replenish myself with ion cores here because I kind of depleted all the ones that I have. Anyway, I'm kind of blabbing away. Sorry about that. Uh, let me just put this in and then we'll get going. There we go. Okay, so I think the base is okay. And now we can move along. So let me see. I have the uh, garrison fully powered up. And as you can see, the Oasis District has 24% power. And that's because I recently found that uh, power transfer uh, relay. And so... Uh, I was able to turn it on and now I want to actually go back out there again and see if I can find it again. It shouldn't be that difficult. Of course I've been away from this game for so long. For all I know I'll get lost out there and then probably get killed but uh, I guess that's an adventure in itself. Okay well here I am trying to get myself ready. I want to open up some space, salvage a few things like these batteries and stuff, and then I think we'll get going. So let me uh, clear some stuff out. I got so many batteries, and I don't really need too many of them since the cyano processor is maxed out. So I think I could get rid of a few of these, although I think I'm getting to the max level for salvage so I may end up not getting anything even if I salvage things okay I'm ready I hope you are cuz we are off and it's been a while since I played this game that for all I know Eden is now just full of zombies I'm not sure I always wonder if I stay away from this game for a little bit do the zombies start multiplying on their own I have no idea but it's a little bit scary since I haven't been out here for a while ok 
Okay. Uh, nobody here. Oh, hey, it's Mr. Robot. You're a sight for sore eyes. I'm hoping that you cleared out a lot of the nasty riffraff around here. You just can't tell. I don't know about the neighbors in this area. Whoa! Whoa! They're all ganging up on you. And there's a few nasty guys over there too. I think one of them is the Reaper. And uh, maybe I could help you out here. Yeah, that one's the Reaper. I'm just hoping he stays... Uh, Interested in you and doesn't come after me, that's for sure. Oh, the Reaper is almost ready to go down. There we go. Okay. Let me keep on helping you out a little bit here. Uh, but you will need to uh, kind of kill them all on your own. There's just a bunch of them. I'm just glad you were out here because I didn't want to run into all these guys. That would be nasty. Uh-oh, oh, 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 whoa. I was a little bit worried that lady, mean lady was going to come after me. Whoa, they took the robot down. They took Mr. Robot down. How dare you take Mr. Robot down? Oh, well. I guess he did his job and I could just clear out the rest of the riffraff that's out here. I can't see the last guy too well. Oh, I must have uh, taken him out at the very end. I wasn't sure. Okay, let's see. Is there anything in interesting around here? Does Mr. Reaper have anything useful? Ah, oh, just a lens. I don't need a lens. Okay, what else? Battery. I don't need battery. I have a ton of batteries. Okay, well, let's keep on going. I don't want to spend all this time collecting loot when I should be going to the power relay. Okay, well, there was a bunch of people in the, or the bunch of zombies in the fifth floor down here. I'm a little bit worried that there's going to be a lot more on the first floor when we get out, so... This might turn out to be not as easy as I thought, even though I know where the relay is now. Whoa, a little bit of a lag. Okay, well, yeah. Uh, first of all, I do apologize that it took so long to make this uh, most recent video. Or that I haven't been making any video. Whoa, there's some guy over there. Let me take care of him first. Oh, I missed. It's nasty, dude. Okay. Whoa, I think I shocked myself. That's not always good. Okay, is he going down? He looks like he's holding his heart. Huh? Whoa! <laughs> oh, Mr. Reaper. You tried to s sneak up on him. I'm just glad my shield was out because he would have... Uh, Kind of uh, ripped me apart because he was behind me. Whoa! No, 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 no. Stay back, stay back. Whoa, you got me, you got me, you got me. That's not good, that's not good. Where am I aiming? Where? Whoa! This is not good, this is not good. Will you just stop following me? Don't you have anything else to do? You know, you know, like, uh, I don't know, watch TV or something? Isn't there anything good on? You know, maybe, uh... Whoa. There we go, we got out of here. Yeah, maybe you should go back to your room and play The Last of Us or something like that. You might like that. Okay, well, anyway, finally he went down. I'm just glad these stairways are here because they do give a little bit of protection. I just hope they don't nerf that thing as well. They've been nerfing a lot of things, and so I'm not as uh, 
confident as I used to be about how well I could survive here. My health is pretty far down, and I guess I could use a medihypo, but I knew. <laughs> wow! Oh man, I'm just glad Mr. Robot is there. Oh, but they they, they took him down. They took him down. No, 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 no. You stay back. You stay back. Anybody else? Oh, there's somebody over there. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Anything? You, uh, I don't want that. I don't want that. Let's close this. Okay, let's get out of here. Do you have anything? Oh, let's take everything. Although I didn't really need that sigil. I'm just a little bit worried. Ah, uh, battery. Gosh. So many batteries. Okay, so we're outside now and it's morning, so I should be able to use my photosynthesis to get my health back and save on the Medihypo. So let me see if I could sit here in sunlight. And yeah, look at that. Ah, oh, the sun feels so warm. Ah, nothing like a good day. A good weather day, although most of the days here are pretty nice weather. If it wasn't for the zombies, this would be a pretty nice place, I have to say. If it wasn't for the zombies and all the dead people that were lying around here. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> You're just everywhere. Not you, but uh, you zombies. I'm a little bit worried. There's just so oh, no 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 nasty dude with armor nasty dude with oh whoa you stay back just stay back stay there yeah yeah whoa just yeah yeah hold on to your heart because oh yeah there we go there we go that's what I wanted you to do. And there's another one of you. Is that another one of you guys? Is that your brother down there? He's kind of acting really weird. Get him! There we go. Can I get him with my... Uh... There we go. Okay, at least my Subversor and Arc Welder combo works pretty well. Adrenaline Hypo. Good. Oh, look at that. When did you get there? I'm just glad you were behind that uh, fence. I didn't need you coming up and uh, beating me up while I was uh, looting everybody else. Let me salvage this. Oh, okay. So it seems like my salvage isn't at 100% yet. Although I got a feeling it's close. Okay, anyway, so it's this direction. So we were... Going in the right direction the last time in the last video when we were looking, but I guess we didn't go far enough. And so, let me take care of these guys. I think there's a Reaper down. Whoa, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm not going to be able to punch him from way out here. Is there a Mr. Robot down there with the guys? I'm not sure. I'm going to have to take a closer look. Which may not be a good idea, but I'm going to do it anyway. Okay, anybody out here outside from those guys over there? Yeah. Oh, by the way, I hear that a new update is coming. And it's kind of, I'm kind of looking forward to it because I think the next update is going to open up the Nirvana district. And although we haven't completely uh, looked at all the areas here, it's always nice to know that a new area is opening up. Now the other thing I hear is that they're going to put multiplayer in and that kind of scares me a little bit because their single player is still buggy as heck. And they're already trying to go for multiplayer and it's interesting because a lot of the players out there are telling the developers will you stop with the multiplayer thing and make the single player game run well because if you look at the reviews on the uh, Steam you notice that none, not too many people complain of the content. They complain of the quality and the bugs. Let me just 
get rid of this guy. Like, the story, a lot of people really say the story is interesting. It's one of the few survival horror games out here that actually has a story and a mystery. And all of that is good. And the biggest problem is that it's buggy. I mean, it kind of lags. It takes a long time to load up. We used to fall through the ground. All these things. And things have improved a little bit. But there's still a lot that can improve. And now they're going into multiplayer. My biggest worry is the moment they load multiplayer, all heck is going to break loose. And the game is going to become really buggy. And then uh, their uh, rating on Steam is going to go down the tubes. It was interesting because uh, for a while, things were going positive. And every time they did an update, it became buggy again. And so every time they uh, updated and then a few more new players would come, it will go from uh, mostly positive back down to mixed. And it was like, wow, why? Why did you do that? Because you were starting to go up on the charts. And then now you did something and now everybody's complaining because it's buggy again. Okay, I'm venting right now. But uh, I just hope nothing really bad happens in the next update in terms of quality. Because even without the, uh, you know, the Nirvana section, there's still a lot to explore here. I haven't done everything yet, and there's still a lot more Pamela things I can do. Yeah, sorry, I'm just kind of uh, hiding back here and shooting from the corner because there's a Widow out there. And no, 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 you stay out there. You stay. No, 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 no. You stay back. You stay back. Okay. Okay. Did I get her? There we go. Okay, and uh, it looks like nobody else. Yeah, okay. Oh. Butcher's Blade. Can I? Yeah, okay. I was able to... Uh, Salvage it. So that was... Whoa! Let me take care of this guy first. And nasty dude with armor. Oh, he ran away from the dart. Stay away. Stay away. No, 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 no. Good. Good. Yeah, okay. Wow, I was gonna spend this uh, episode quickly getting to the power relay and showing you where it is and then we could kind of quickly uh, leave off with this game. But it's taking a lot longer than I expected. I just didn't realize that there would be so many zombies on the way there. But this is the last power transfer relay I need to find, uh, at least until Nirvana opens up. And once I know where this location is, I'll know the location of all the uh, power relays. Actually, I already know where it is, but I might as well show you where it is in this video. And then I would have uh, visited every one of the power relays that are available at the moment. This is scary. There's just so many nooks and crannies where, uh, whoa, there's a zombie. Is that a reaper? I think that's a reaper. Okay. Okay. Whoa. Stay there. Stay there. No, 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 no. Can I take him out? Come on, come on. Come on, please. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's coming down here. Ah, there we go. Okay. Okay. Okay, onwards, onwards. We need to look for that power station. Is there another Reaper up there? 
It's like Reaper City right now. It's not doing much of anything. Maybe he just doesn't even notice that I'm back here. Okay, anyway. I'm not here to hunt Reapers. I'm the here to uh, turn on Pamela units and look for the relay. So we're getting there. We're almost there. See, it was saying that it was near Arc Medical, and I guess it's this Arc Medical. It's one of these little tiny uh, mini clinics. It's not that big hospital. And here is the relay. So we almost came here the last time, and then we just decided to uh, go back because it was getting dark. But uh, now, at least you know, well, at least uh, we've gone through all the relays. You may have already known where it was anyway. Okay, so this is one of those ARC Medical Clinics, and this is pretty nice uh, in the sense that if you do ever do get to a point where you do need some uh, healing, then you could come here and go to one of these healing stations. Uh, let me pick up this credit. And it's the typical thing, you know, you see all these healing stations and you have to pay some credits and then they'll fully heal you back, I guess. Anyway, right now I have enough Medi-Hypos and, um... Hmm... Oh, this is talking about that bone issue. Yeah, so the uh, citizens of Eden were afflicted by some sort of bone issue. And it seems like it's not due to any sort of calcium deficiency or anything according to these notes. But uh, whatever the case, they tried to create an antidote for it. And I got a feeling that's one of the things that killed everybody. Because you see all these bones sticking out of everybody's faces and stuff like all the dead people's faces anyway. And so I don't know what they did, but they sure Jenkins did it wrong. Relaxed. He communicates intently with Hekin on the phone, smiling intermittently. Okay, well... Jacob, that guy just seems really shady now. I don't know, between the reason, for whatever reason, Emma dying and then Jacob standing over her body. You know, all this weird trickery going on. I just don't know. Is Jason going to be the antagonist here? Did he purposely tr do something to those treatments to uh, kill everybody? And what will be his motive? Because, you know, why would he want Eden, Eden all uh, barren? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I still have no idea what's going on That's in terms of what's the reasoning for uh, this happening. It doesn't seem like a natural event. And so who's behind it? Of course, we haven't really met anybody except Pamela, so it's really hard to figure out if there's anybody behind it. You know, the deep frame, for example. And eventually, if you look at some of the uh, regions that you still can't go to because they haven't opened up, one is the deep region. And so I got a feeling that's where the deep frame is, and maybe that's one of the last regions that, you, that will open up and you can uh, explore. Yeah, sorry, I'm just looking around to see if there's any more zombies. Right now we should be okay because we're right in uh, open sunshine. And... Uh, yeah, okay, we're in open sunshine so photosynthesis should be working. So even if I get hit, I should be recovering pretty quickly. So that should be good. I'm just leaving this garden here because it's kind of a good sign. I know where I am if I keep on seeing this garden here. Okay, can I pick this up now? I couldn't the last time. There we go. Okay, anybody out here? Anybody out here? Uh, I'm just gonna do a little bit of exploration in this area and see if oh there's that's a <laughs> mystery how many of you are he, are there i thought there was a bunch of nasty dudes with armor a while back but now it's just reapers 
And compared to Reapers, nasty dude with armors are like uh, walk in the park. This game is getting harder. And I just hope I don't get killed because I really don't want to start from the beginning if possible. I do have one of those, uh, what do you call it? Uh, cryos, cryo orbs or whatever. I think I turned on the cryo station and arc medical, so I should be okay, but if possible, I would like to keep on going. Okay, well, it's already 1.30 in, uh, in game time, and so I don't want to spend too much more time out here. Uh, pretty soon we'll be going back. I just want to kind of take a look around. I've been here before. I thought that we were coming into new areas, but I've been here before. This is where we went the last time we were looking for the power relay. Instead of going to where the power relay... Hey, flying robot, how are you doing? Okay, instead of going to where the power relay was, uh, we ended up going this way, which was, of course, the wrong way. How are you doing? You uh, looking after the area? Okay, what's down here? Oh, I think I know where that is. That's the train station. Oh, there's a bunch of uh, nasty dudes with armor. There's two of them. They must be twins or clones. Anyway, yeah, we're near the train station. I didn't realize that the uh, power relay was near the train station. So, uh, yeah. I think one of these days I'll make a video that shows where all the power stations are, but uh, that'll be another time. I just need to get back alive. If I get killed, then I don't. It's the power relays are the last things I have to worry about. Sorry, I'm trying out this rage uh, mode, and I can't seem to hit that guy no matter what I try to do. I wanted to see if he got angry enough to start fighting the other nasty dude with armor, but uh, I just couldn't test it out right now. Okay, well, rage mode in the subversor is still kind of uh, questionable f about its usefulness. I guess I'll stick to poison. Okay, let's go back. We're going back. We know where the power relay is, and that was the only thing I wanted to do with this video. And it's already been quite a bit of time. Exodus Station. Yeah, I think that's what the train station's called. Okay. Whoa, whoa! Flying rope. Oh, there's a guy there. There's, uh, there's another guy. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? No, 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 no. Ah, oh, no. Stupid flying robot, you ran into the lightning ball of lightning and then you got angry because you ran into the ball of lightning and you think I attacked you. Uh, are you going to still come after me? Uh, am I going to get killed by Mr. Robot now that you're angry at me as well? Uh, by the way, are you still out there? I don't want to see you anymore. If possible, just forget about it. Forget about that well, whole thing happening. Uh, just go on your way. Okay, we're back here again. Okay, let's go back down to the fifth floor. And are we going to see a bunch of zombies? Oh, yeah. There's just zombies everywhere today. And luckily, they're always fighting Mr. Robot. I don't want them fighting me, so... Uh Get him, Mr. Robot. Get well, no, 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 no. Don't come over here. What the heck is he doing? Oh, is he angry at me because of the flying robot? Because the flying robot was after me? Oh, wow. Are you trying to kill me too? Oh, there's Mr. Reaper. And for the moment... Whoa, there's two Mr. Reapers. Whoa, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Stay back, stay back. 
We'll get to the chopper. Whoa! Mean lady. Mean lady. Where did all these guys come from? They like pop out of nowhere. Whoa, they like pop out of nowhere. I think that I'm kind of shooting myself throughout this entire. Oh, there's a robot guy up there. So hopefully he'll take care of Mr. Reaper and I could go down while they're beating each other up. And thank you very much, Mr. Robot. Wow, I think I'm just gonna take it easy. This is it for this video. I don't want Mr. Robot coming after me, so I'm hoping by that by next episode, uh, everything would have calmed down. I think if you wait long enough, the uh, flying robots forget about you, and then you can go back to doing what you wanted to do, such as take out this zombie here. There we go. Okay, I want to get back. I want to get back. I don't need to pick up any more loot. I maxed out in salvage. I don't really need any more credits and I should have more than enough food and drinks. So overall, we're in pretty good shape. Okay, we're almost back, but I don't want to get amb- Oh! Oh, there's a flying robot. Now that we're back near our station, let's see if this flying robot will get back here. Get back here. Okay, are you going to get angry at me after you scam me? Okay, let's see. Whoa, okay, good. Flying robot didn't get angry at me, so I guess uh, things have cooled off a little bit. And let me just check to see if there's any zombies. No zombies, anything good here? Uh, oh, upgrade kits. Let me get all these upgrade kits. I might as well use my credits for something. I never know when I'll get killed and I need to start making new weapons again, so... I always buy more upgrade kits. I'm hoping that even if I get killed, my upgrade kits will transfer to my new me. Uh, so that I could um, build and then max out my weapons right away. Okay, so we're back here again. And, uh, good. Well, that's it for today. Uh, I only wanted to really show where that relay was and I guess it was a good thing that that's all I did because there was like two million zombies, well maybe not two million, maybe like, but a few more than two, uh, a few zombies anyway between here and the relay. But uh, yeah, uh, now that we're done I think we could go back to exploring Garrison until the Nirvana station opens up. And uh, there's still a lot to do with the garrison. So I'll be looking at the upper floor the next time. And I uh, hope you join us at that time. But uh, thank you very much. I, once again, I apologize that it took so long between the last video and this one. But uh, hopefully we could get back on track to exploring once again. It's always a pleasure to make these videos for you. If you have any comments, please post them in the comments section below. And anyway, we'll continue to make more Pamela uh, videos. And so long as uh, the developers don't screw it up by uh, bugging this game up when they do another update, I'll continue to make these videos. So I uh, look forward to going on the next adventure with you. Uh, happy gaming until that time. And as always, giant nice day, everyone.